Hello Cancer, this is going to be your reading for the next 72 hours. We're just going to do a nice little quick read for you and see what comes out for the next 72 hours. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see more content. And if you would like to get a personal reading from me, make sure you check out the description box. I have $15 text message reads and $20 video readings. That is in the description box at the link below, okay? So we have resiliency, obstacles and trials, a time to tap into your reserves. Sometimes we have to grit our teeth and get through things to get it done in this life, okay? So resilience, resiliency is your oracle right now. So there is gonna be something in the next 72 hours that you're just gonna have to like bear down and get through it, okay? Even though you've been working hard as it is, it's time to work even harder. It's really trying time to get that hustle on, which is not hard for cancers, okay? So you're gonna be really busy probably, but you can handle it, so don't worry. All right, so let's see. What do you have for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the next 72 hours? We have the Queen of Pentacles. You best believe it. Okay, you guys are definitely tapping into your um, opposite side, your seventh house. Okay, if you're looking at the Cancer Access, you're, def you're definitely tapping into that workaholic energy, that business energy. Okay, um, some of you guys are definitely trying to make a goal happen. You're trying to accomplish something here. All right, let's see. Wow. All right, we have the Three of Cups. Okay, and we have the King of Cups. I see success. Whatever it is that you're trying to focus on that is career related, this can be a business, this can be trying to throw a function, a party. Okay, I see a success for you with the Sun card. Okay, um, I also see someone showing up in your life in the next 72 hours. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I don't really like this person's energy because it does it, it does kind of feel a little non-committal. But if you're in that space in your life and you're not looking for something like serious right now, there is like an earth sign or maybe another water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, that is showing up in your energy in the next 72 hours. Keep it in your mind though that this person has some sort of third party or there is some sort of non-committal energy about this person. Okay. I do feel like some of you will be meeting this person at a party, okay? So if you have a party planned in the next 72 hours, it's Thursday as I film this, so this could definitely apply to the weekend. You might meet someone at a party, okay? Yeah, we have the strength card. Interesting. Lots of work. I'm hearing work, 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 work. You guys, are, maybe you guys are trying to figure out if you should go to a party or not. Um, you should. I feel like you should go. Maybe you're like, no, I have to have to work. Some of you are going to meet a Leo or there's going to be a Leo at a party. Like maybe you're wondering if you'll see this person. Like maybe there's someone you're wondering. Yeah, because I'm here when I see you by Fantasia in my head. Never know when you might walk by. So I got to be right on time when I see you. Some of you, it's a Pisces. So you're either going to get a message from this person or you're going to see somebody that you love. <laughs> this It feels like it could be a new person, but this person, uh, nine of cups, they have a lot of love already. They have So it feels like someone you already know. You already know this person. You can see them at a party unexpectedly or maybe you do expect to see this person at a party and you see them there. Um, they have a lot of love for you. So let's see what, ha what happens when you meet up with this person or you see this person. It feels like you see this person when other people are around. So it doesn't feel like it's just you two there. The death card. Ooh, some of you guys might wind up trying to end things with this person. I did see the five of wands. The Ten of Pentacles. Oh, some of you, this person is going to tell you, because that's why this Ten of Swords, when guard, cards are already flipped over before I start a reading, I don't take them. But the Ten of Swords, as you guys can see without throughout this reading, has been like showing itself to me. So maybe this person is going to tell you that they've ended a relationship with someone. Okay, they could tell you that they're not married anymore, that they've gotten a divorce. Okay, um, that there's no, there's no longer competition. Okay. Uh, this doesn't have to be a marriage. They could have been in a long-term relationship with someone else. They could be telling you that it was, it's over with that person. Now, if it's the other way around, you could be telling this person that you're done. You don't want to continue the relationship with them because you don't want to be a third party. Either way it goes, this looks like a conversation or it's a meetup with somebody in the next 72 hours. Okay. Now keep in mind, if this doesn't happen in the next 72 hours, this could be a timeless reading. This can happen in the future. Maybe you guys just need to hear this right now. Yes. Yeah, some of you guys have someone non-committal, a pipe sees or something somebody is leaving a marriage though too so i'm getting two different storylines i'm like i'm getting somebody who's non-committal that's coming into your life or you're meeting this person meeting up with this person having a conversation with them could be telling them you don't want anything to do with them anymore because you realize that they're non-committal don't want to keep going around in a cycle with them for others of you there is someone who was already committed elsewhere they were already married to someone else and they are um, approaching you. They are seeing you and they're telling you that they're, they're out of their marriage. 
they're out of their relationship, okay? But if you are looking for some sort of career success in the next 72 hours, I see that happening for you, Cancer, all right? Someone likes some titties. Yeah, so be careful with non-committal people, especially earth signs. Capricorn towards Virgo. Just be careful with some non-committal energy that's coming in, okay? One way or the other. There's definitely someone here that is looking at you sexually, okay? Um, with the Nine of Cups, yes, they love you a lot, but are they willing to commit? That's the question you have to ask yourself. So I hope that this makes sense, Cancer. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments, and I'll see you guys for the next reading. If you need a personal for me, check out the description box. Love you. Bye.